It's Defender Episode 3. I know you were all waiting for it. Game Bros Color. This is Matt. Tim to my right. How's it going? And we're going to Al... Fucking this place. Let's do it. Aldivai Gorge Rhea. Yeah. <laughs> I was kind of hoping it would just like start right away and get right in the action. No, we got the load screen. No. Pick your ship. I'll pick the super fast ship, man. That went so well. Oh, Hope I got the next one, which remember, is my favorite. Remember Colonist number 32? That died? That's his favorite ship, too. It's the last one he saw. Yeah. He's like, wow, this guy's doing some really cool tricks before he picks me up. Okay, I'm getting kind of close to the ground, though. If you want to pick... You just... You want to pick you pick me up? And then he exploded. Because he died. Uh, I'd go with what you had before. I think it was tearing him apart. Oh, well, yeah, but I could buy new things. And on yeah, the better versions, I'd say, next time I get enough money, I can get the ratchet gun. The ratchet cannon, which is better because it seeps into things. Oh, that does sound pretty good. Yeah. But does it make sense to upgrade a ship if you're not going to use it? If you get your next ship? Well, I get as uh, you know, much money in this game. It's ridiculous. Oh, really? Yeah. The fucking... Answer your phone! The ringing is annoying. Cool things are for me. Cool. Like me. Right, keep your eyes open. Strange readings. Strange. You saying I like dudes? <laughs> Taking you folks down. Uh, ah! I don't like surprises, especially when they include it. Never mind. Dudes. <laughs> I was gonna say anal. <laughs> that sounded really gross after I started to say it, though, so I stopped. Especially when they include butt stuff. There we go. Some missile bros here. Butt stuff is a funny combination of words. Butt stuff monthly. <laughs> Protect the drop zone. What, you spawned right there? Why did they even attack at any point? You should have killed me before they got there. That was it. Yeah, that was two guys. Alright. Can you pick up more than one? Nope. That would be stupid. Why did I ask? Can you put them on the sides of the missile, like the rocks and stuff? Or do they have to be on the ground? They have to be on the ground, I think. Oh, okay. Then this getting like a higher up perch might be good, but... This whole area... It's like they took the desert area and just... Turned it white. It looks exactly the same. Some snow in the background? Yeah, just put snow. That's the only difference. The manti are on the rising. Hey, commander voice. Be cooler. You got it, bro. Bro. Okay, find all the colonists. And they're like in the stupid things over here. Oh, there's more of those guys. Sweet. Where are the colonists? Aren't they where the arrows are pointing? Nope. What's the arrow pointing at? Uh, the... where I bring them. Oh. So, forget it. Forget about it. Why are the colonists way over here anyway? I uh -huh. You gotta do risk assessment. Going over here in an alien attack, not a good idea. Maybe stay by the safe zone? Just well, the they thought, guys. Well, then. It's all about risk assessment, though. Hit the shit. <laughs> Uh, you're the best space pilot. Colonists. Uh oh. Are you sure about that? No, but I'm gonna. I don't bring these, these missile guys over here. They're getting eaten. On the same spot so that they can protect each other. Good idea. So, are you gonna let this guy fall to his death too, or? Hopefully not. I kind of hope you do. Caught him. Oh, you got him. That guy has some quick hands if he was able to grab onto you there. Where are they? They're right there. So technically, if you just let them all That's die... The burner, uh, is he? Guys, they're all on the burner. <laughs> if you just let them die, you would beat the mission anyway, right? No, I think so. What's the point, then? Why risk yourself? You don't know points? these guys. Yeah, but I'm talking about if this was real. You don't know these guys. You don't know their names. Oh, that guy's... There's no way you're saving him. He's gone. He's gone. <laughs> Not even gonna try? This guy... Maybe he's close enough to the ground that he didn't die. He didn't. Uh, yeah, he survived. Look at that. And you're just going to let him go. There's actually two guys there. 
Turn around and get the other one. Turn back into him? Nope. Uh, faster. Oh, that is hilarious that they're holding onto the burners. Yeah. That's a terrible place to hold on. Uh, they're not going to start getting through there. There's too many missile dudes. Missile dudes? Yup. Missile bros. Yellow guys. Do the Were there enemies... more guys over here? Yeah, yeah, there were a couple more. Yeah. Do the enemies ever change what they look like? Or are they always green, yellow, red? Uh, there's different enemies and stuff. Oh, okay. Later in the game, there's more and more stuff. Gotcha. Suck more and more to kill. Who that? Is that the last friendly right there? Oh, uh, that over this area, yeah. Uh, there's a couple more in that little cove I left behind. Oh, okay. See, they're never going to get through that. So you know you've been playing this for a while. How do the controls compare to the GameCube version? Still a little bit sensitive on the gamer. A little loose. That PS2 control... Actually, no, that's a new newer PS2 controller, so it shouldn't have much use in it, actually. Because my last one broke right when I was, like, I think 30 hours into Persona 4, <laughs> and it broke. Oh, God. It stopped working, and You're I was like, like oh, oh, oh stop. <laughs> no, 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 no. So I had to go to Walmart, and oh, they actually no. still had PS2 color controllers for sale. Nice. For 40 bucks. I was like, you serious, guys? So I had to decide, do I want to spend an extra $20 that I don't need to? <laughs> or order it off eBay. I decided oh, I could not wait for Persona. These things. So that controller is only a few years old. But it has hundreds of hours of use because of all the RPGs I've been playing. Any more guys in this alcove? Alcove? I don't see any. Alright. Then get out of there, man. They're shooting your shit. They're trying to. Do, 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 do. Okay, this I just guy that's around needs to die. Hit a missile, guys. <laughs> I think he's dead. Any more dudes left to save? Fuck, it's a missile guy. No, I don't think so. You never really checked, like, the side in between those two spots. Like, straight ahead over there. They shouldn't be over here. You never know. One of those things. No, oh, no. Objective complete. A nice lady robot voice just said something. Memory. 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 Nice. Wait, that's its name? Yep. Memory. I'm gonna do some Fen lifting while you play this. Oh, that's drops. okay. Oh, shit. <laughs> if you're, f if you're little two pound weights. Yeah, man. No, seriously? Tongue. You do these, it's nothing. Nothing for like 10 minutes. And then afterwards, you start to think about it like, holy shit. It starts to get to you. It does actually do, well, I actually do it like up and then like this, and like twist them over. Man, I gotta get toned. Yeah? Yeah, we're gonna get famous on YouTube. I need to be able to hold all the bitches on my arms that I'm gonna have crawling all over me. Oh, yeah, this thing. Raw! I dropped Holy one of these. Fuck, what's that thing? I dropped one of these weights right on my inner thigh a couple days ago, and yeah. I was like tossing in the air and catching it, literally two inches away from the balls. <laughs> that would have been bad. I mean, three pounds is not a lot, but it hits there. It's a lot. Yeah. Hey, this is like the things from Judgment. Gears of yeah. War, the centipede thing. Yeah. You shoot it in the ass until it dies. More or less. This is the thrilling boss okay, fight. I gotta go get help. Oh yeah, you do. Is there this help? Is where yeah, it's somewhat help. nice. <laughs> Fucking miss everything. <laughs> uh, oh, jeez, didn't do anything. You got your health back. Wait, if you saved everybody here, why the hell do you need to worry about killing this thing? Well, because it's gonna be here forever otherwise. Oh, you don't even need to destroy it in order? No. Nope. Oh, but it stays alive. Okay, yeah, it breaks into more pieces. Die. Are you going to be able to beat this before you die? Yeah. Oh, that's it? Yep. Oh, I thought there were way more pieces than that. Nope. See ya. Woo! Go through it and get some back. <laughs> you hit the, <laughs> you hit the <laughs> mountain on the other side. Blow up. <laughs> Game over. They're like, don't worry, I can fly full speed at this thing. <laughs> that's what Stargates are for! Hey man, we haven't activated the Stargate yet. Whoops. 
Okay, yeah, just head to the target whenever you want. Okay, ooh. <laughs> Damn it, Steve, you didn't hit the button! <laughs> Code red security alert. Code brown security alert. Now listen, I'ma keep y'all close, Commander. We have some sensitive work going on in the colonies. So deal with it. I'm gonna break my controller. Stop. It's sensitive. Oh, a colonist got killed. I guess that one who dropped from two feet did get killed. Uh, that sucks. Star date 2934, part two. <laughs> Our second colonist has died. Also, not picked up by that asshole pilot from before. Why do we keep him on the staff? Doop. Put it in the books. Let's kill the giant monster thing. Centipede demon. Centipede demon. He is just following us to every single game. Showed up in Crimson Dragon. Aeneas. Aeneas River. <laughs> That's funny. River. Titan. Come on, new ship. My favorite one. What is your favorite thing about it? Why is it your favorite one? What's so best good about weapons. it? Oh, best weapons? Yeah. What about its speed? It's not as fast as this one, but it's about as fast as the first one. Okay. And armor? Better. Better? So it's pretty much... Is it the last ship you get? No. Oh, how many ships are in the game? Six. Six? Yep. I don't have money for the ratchet cannon yet, but I can get the volley missile. Super trident. <laughs> I killed the guy with the... Oh, so the super trident does five missiles. Oh. Because it makes sense it's still a trident, right? Yeah. I killed a guy with a yeah. trident. You did, Brick. I saw that. I stabbed a guy in the heart with a trident. Yeah, that's what it was. I love lamp. I love carpet. I love desk. Brick, are you just saying? Are you just looking at things in the room and saying you love them? I love wall. <laughs> I can't remember the exact line. It's not a long line. Today. Do you want to come to a pants party? No. Do you want to come to a party in my pants? No. He says pants party. No. Party in my pants. Huh? It's uh. No. She says. He says. He says. Do you want to go go to a pants party? She's like, Brick, are you asking me to go to a party in your pants? Yes. yes. That. Okay. That's what it was. Yeah. <laughs> Brick, did Ron ask you to say that? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Okay, Brick. I don't want to go to a party in your pants. Thank Fair you. enough. Fair enough. Jim! Would you like to go to a party in my pants? <laughs> I can't... It's been so long since I saw the original... You can probably go beyond this. Probably. Since I saw the original Anchorman, but there's so many good lines in that movie, it is unbelievable. <laughs> One of the funniest movies of all time. Yeah, it is. Sex Panther. 60% of the time it works. Every time. time. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> You'll see. He just walks out there. Veronica. He's like... Oh, oh, what is that smell? <laughs> it smells like... I can't remember. I know the one lady comes by. He's like, oh, it smells like Bigfoot's dick. <laughs> oh, that oh, is a funny, mission. funny movie. The second one was still funny, too, but it was too long. Yeah. That was but... the problem with it. It went on too long. The first one's relatively short, but the second one's like two and a half hours. But it's still funny. But they it cut some of the, the stuff out. Battle at the end. Yeah. yeah. It was really weird. <laughs> It was unrealistic. The History Channel had actual history things with it, not aliens. Remember when the History Channel actually used to be about history? That was boring, yeah. <laughs> now it's fun. It is. I don't watch the History Channel. I do. Where are all my missiles? Blow your missile load right down its face. Wait, what just dropped to the ground? Bombs, I think. No. He is dead. I like this music, though. It's like sick disco beats or something. The yeah, remix version of the original games. Songs. The original games? Yep. The original, a... the old school defender, the original this is based off of. Oh, really? Yeah. Are you it's talking like about a... Galaga? No. It was an actual game called Defender, man. Really? Yep. Huh. It's a side scroller, basically. Right. Well, that's what Galaga was. I guess yeah. Galaga is just the way better and more popular version of Defender. Pretty much. <laughs> Strong things. You know, this game reminds me of another game, and I really can't put my finger on it. It's bothering me. It's yeah. on the N64. 
Uh -huh. They were like, no, no, no. It wasn't really flying around like this. There were like alien bugs everywhere. Maybe like Blast Corpse or something. I don't know why it would remind me of that. I think you were on ground the whole time. Not many good games on the N64. There's a lot of shovelware shit. But people remember it fondly because of the few really, really good games that were on it. Pretty much like every Nintendo console. Ratchet guns where it's at. Duh. That doesn't look much different than what you had before. Is it actually firing more? No, it's the same gun. Oh. It's the same one. It's just... <laughs> I'm firing on the other weapons to see if they're good, but... You might want to get some so health. Fucking okay. Holy shit. I, I just saw it so down. I was like, wait a sec. Uh-oh. Jesus. That thing destroyed the hell out of you. What was that? I don't know. It didn't look any different. It Something hit you from the side. It oh. wasn't the thing you were fighting. Maybe it was... One of those yellow things with its volley blast of death. This guy has not very good armor. Probably one of these things that fire a million shots. Probably, yeah. But it was red. I don't know. It was something. Maybe there's a mutant somewhere. It was something suck. that tore you apart. Yeah, mutants destroy you. Is there no, there's no civilians on this map, though, is there? No. But sometimes they spawn them by themselves. Oh, really? Yeah. Nice. They're dicks like that. Like what? That do stuff like that. Oh, I thought you were going to describe what bad their dicks things. look like. No. Okay. I'd actually like to know what the alien dicks look like. I mean, does that make me weird? Or? Probably. No. That's why I can't talk to people. one of those red things that's getting me. Those things hurt. Destroy the stingray. Oh, it's that thing again. Yeah. You killed it once, now you have better weapons. You should be able to kill it easily. Try to yep. kill it really easily. You might want to grab some health if there's any available. What's this health of which you speak? Okay. Okay. What is that pointing out? The where I'm supposed to be defending right now, more or less. The bridge? Oh, no, the that train thing. thing. Yeah. Yep, yep. Okay, where the hell is? Is there health somewhere? There'll be a little, a little white health pack. I don't see any. There's a million of them. Is that health right there? Where? Right behind you on the ground. There's boxes. Shoot them and the health will come out. Oh, yeah. You actually gotta hit him, though, yeah. Not much health, but you know. See what you can get. See, it's, it's just too sensitive. <laughs> that and I can't yeah. hit stuff. Oh, Jesus. Just, just grab the health, man. There. Okay. So, they're probably destroying you up. They're destroying the bridge. That doesn't matter anymore. Yeah, there's one more, I think. Yep. Wow, really? Why weren't they closer together? Do they not realize they're in an alien apocalypse? Well, apart, they have better chances of surviving. Except for when you're defending them. They have better chances of surviving if they stay together. Because they just get there at the same time. It's over. What is this? Is that another one? No, that's something you got to pick up. No. Yeah, it was small. Go back to that. It was a missile guy. Yeah, pick it up. I could, but then you won't defend the thing. So the job is to defend this thing right now. Oh. Pull the line, hero. Do you want to actually hit them, maybe? Nah. Dude, kill the stingray. Mm. Another one of these things. Use you. Some missiles. Die. It'll die eventually. These are the better fast lock missiles. Kills everything. Explosion noise. This thing's also gonna kill me. If you actually hit things like that, it's strong. way to do it. Yeah, that's that shotgun attack, right? This one? Or the one you were talking about you have to be an inch away? Yeah, that's the... this one. Wait, no. 
this one. It's really slow. Oh, those are like bubbles. Yeah. How much longer is this level? Till the last convoy goes or whatever. See, almost there. I feel like this level has overstayed its welcome. Oh, Would you be up? Please say you have more lives. I want more life, yeah. Thank God. I'm not bad about this mission. Twice. Ugh. Are you are you moving yet? Can't you just like pick it up? Well, I can't pick up the big thing here. Maybe you have to pick that up. For what? Yeah. It's like a protect the convoys is there. Put that in the bridge. Put it where it's pointing it out. It's pointing right there. Oh, you pick up the other one. I don't fucking. I don't know. Help me by shooting these things. Literally nothing is happening. Did the game break? Nope. Just a long mission. Fantastic. Boom. Tanks are strong. Kill them as they spot in. Oh, if Tank broke here, I can probably do it. Ugh, do they make it here yet? I don't even see anything. That's why I think something's wrong with this game right now. They're not marking it out or anything. That's that right there, isn't it? Pick that one up, see what happens. Put it somewhere else. No. Oh. There we are, finally. Nothing changed, though. I don't... Whatever. Play that sweet, sweet victory music. Never mind. This is like that one friggin' level in Smash Bros. With uh, Marth and Ike and Meta Knight. Yeah. It just never ended. <laughs> this is never ending. No, nah, they just showed this thing blow up. It doesn't matter. You saved everyone out of there, didn't you? Yeah. And then they blew up. And then they all... Why? Why they did they destruct it? Why? <laughs> what? That's why you evacuated. It's like a self-destruct, I think. I'm... I feel like I'm missing... Oh, God, that screen is bright. <laughs> oh. Black for you guys. But it yeah. It just turns blue for some reason. Horrible, horrible. Horribly bright blue. Oh, my God. <laughs> I think I'm partially blinded. Blow the Buggers. Yeah, I saw a movie called Blow the Buggers. Did you? Yeah. You want to know what it was about? What? Blowing up aliens. And then fucking them in the mouth. Alright, we're done here? Boom. Yep. Hey, episode 3 of Defender. Hey, you saved all the civilians that were non-existent. Good job. Yep. Cannot fault you for that. I'm going to keep the logbook closed for now. All the colonist deaths. So, I'm going to break my controller. I'm going to break your face. <laughs> Thanks for watching Defender Episode 3. We'll catch you next time when we play it again. Yep. See you later. Goodbye, everybody.